points on that class, even with the two big players in there, Jerome James and Calvin Booth. Still not a very good defensive rebounding team. And I say not very good. Last in the league. Come away with it. Cavaliers, the offensive end. She was a little strange not to see number 23 in the floor. Tony Bati. Oh, that's man size with power. He just baptized Calvin Booth. Defense of the Sonics. Booth taking a little bit of a risk there going on the outside, or I should say the inside around the outside to try to get a piece of that shot. And although Booth a good yes. last week, got to tell you a story about that. Though. It was Boozer. The two front quarters had uh, given the Cavaliers their first nine. Oh, Jerome wow. James got swatted by Tony Batista with the three point shot and with running the floor. Boozer being doubled. Found Bati with a tremendous look for the crush. And a uh, five man group for Seattle right now because all four of their perimeter players can shoot the three and that really spreads things out. Target where a guy can catch and finish if you send a little man a point even better. Tony Bati here. They were down by 14 late first half. Tony Batte, tough jumper, going to get to the line. Have really picked it up from the free throw stripe. It's that's the problem when you're playing against Ray Allen. You can play exceptional defense, and he's still going to find ways to score. Tony Batte with power found the bottom of the defensive lead. Nate McMillan trying to go with two big guys, and if it's not there, don't force it. Shot clock inside ten, but T wants it. Whirling baseline. Tony Batte with strength in traffic. He shot in back to back losses to Golden C. Tony Batte on the evening as he connects on his second throw.